I am back with another wig review. So let's get right into it. Okay, y'all, so we have the package here, 28 inches. It's a loose, deep wave texture, and it is 4x4 four four lace closure wig. So obviously it comes with some wig caps. And y'all, here's the wig we leave out. Okay, y'all, so the wig is open and out of the package. Um, I don't know about this one, y'all. I don't know about this one. The texture is really pretty, but the hair is just like dry. Maybe you're supposed to wet this, and it's like shedding already. Um. The texture is really pretty, but this is not it. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I don't know if you're supposed to wet loose deep wave hair. Okay, y'all, so I searched it up. It says that you can wet loose deep wave hair. So I'm gonna try to spray some water the hair like reacts with water that's a little bit better honestly but there is like a lot of shedding i don't know about this one you guys i'm even going to add some mousse and try to um brush it down a little bit just because this wig is very affordable and the pattern is really pretty honestly so i just want to give it a fair chance because like i said i searched it up and they said that you can wet the hair so i'm gonna do that and add some of my narabi Styling foam, brush through it. Okay, that's not too bad. So this is how it looks after you like wet it. now this is what it's looking like it's looking a lot better than before and i believe like once it dries the texture will just be really pretty because it is definitely like a loose wave and this is how the front i mean the top looks um without you know any added moisture or styling products or anything like that but you guys you know with it like being you know you kind of have to put in a little bit extra effort with this one because i don't usually do anything in my other reviews but you know with the extra efforts i feel like it's worth the shot because this wig is only 111 dollars so i would say you know if you don't mind obviously like wedding in and whatever like you know this is i would say it's a pretty good wig because the texture is really beautiful even like when it's dry this is really pretty and i like i said i do believe once this dries, it'll be even more beautiful. And like, of course, when we took it out the package, it wasn't really giving, but you know, when we added, when we gave it what it needed, it showed us a different side. The only thing I would say is that there is like a good amount of shedding with this wig. So I would just be aware of that. Um, the lace, is pretty good it looks more of like a medium brown than a transparent or anything but you know if you have like a warmish skin tone this will work with you and um yeah like you can see i can see i'm pretty light skinned and this is how it goes um the lace looks on my hand so um this is what the knots are looking like 
pretty average, honestly. Like, not too good, not too bad. And then let's just do a little length check for everybody. So, like they said, this was 28 inches. So, let's see. Oh, yeah, this is definitely 28 inches. Okay, well, if I had the wig on my head, it would probably fall to about right here. And if you stretch it down, I don't know. It's giving like a 26 inch. But I don't know. Everybody's different. So all in all, you guys, like I said, you do have to kind of, you know, vamp this wig up when it comes out of the package. Because it was like really frizzy and frayed at first. But um, as long as you just add your styling mousse and some water, you'll be okay. And um... Like I said, the lace is good. You know, there's a lot of room in the wig cap. It comes with an adjustable band. It also comes with some clips to secure your install. So despite the um, questionable first impression, I would recommend this wig because like I said, it's very affordable and um, the texture is really pretty. You know what I'm saying? You honestly get what you pay for it. Like, like I said, this wig is only $111, which is very affordable for human hair wig. But all in all, you guys, it's not too bad. But you guys, we are at the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, turn your post notifications on. So when I post a video, you'll be the first to watch. And also, if any other wig or hair companies would like to collaborate and promote your brand, then just go ahead and click the description down below. And there you can find all of my contact information so that we can communicate and set up, you know, a promotion. So, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned to my next video. And like I said, don't forget to subscribe, like, just tap again, you feel me? Like, follow my social medias, they're always linked down below. And until the next one.